Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another episode of Cookmas where every day in December I'm sharing a new recipe. So today's recipe is lasagna soup and I'm taking out approximately eight ounces of lasagna noodles and then I'm going to break them up in pretty small pieces. I also have some water boiling because I'm going to cook the noodles individually which I'm pretty certain you can cook them in there, but I didn't try to do it that way. I just follow the recipe. I'm also taking a package of mild Italian sausage and I'm going to score all of them and remove the casings so that we can cook them. Fairly easy to do, but always kind of grosses me out, <laughs> but you have to do it. So here we go. Then I'm going to take my Dutch oven, add some olive oil, heat it up, and then break up all the sausage and cook it until it's all nice and brown. Then I'm going to add some garlic, which I always over add garlic because I love it. And you're supposed to add chopped onion, but my family hates onions. So I just add a bunch of onion powder to kind of get some of the flavor. But if you're not scared of onions like my family, then go ahead and add it. I think onions are delicious and it would have made this recipe way better, but it was already delicious without it. So after a few minutes, then I added in a few tablespoons of tomato paste. And I will have the full list of directions and ingredients below in the description box. I'm also going to add some Italian seasoning and mix that for a moment. And next I'm adding in a couple cups of water and then a jar of marinara sauce. In hindsight, I should have dumped in the marinara sauce and then put the water in the jar. That way I can get the remainder of the sauce out. But you know, sometimes you don't think of things until after you've already done them. Then I'm adding in four cups of chicken stock or chicken broth rather. And I always hold the spoon over it so it doesn't splash everywhere. Kind of helps it from doing that. And I 100% think you could have put the lasagna in and cooked it in all this because it's enough liquid, but I did cook them individually. So now I'm adding the cooked noodles and some of the pieces look pretty big. So I definitely could have made them smaller or use a different type of noodle. You don't have to use lasagna noodles. So then I did season it with some pepper. And I did add cream to it, but for some reason that file got corrupted. So you don't actually see me putting it in there, but I did add a little bit of heavy cream and then some Parmesan cheese. Let everything heat up and stirred it and it's good to go. Did say to top it with a dollop of ricotta cheese and some more Parmesan cheese. And this was delicious. Tastes exactly like lasagna, but in soup form. So, so good. So if you guys like to try it, make sure you check out the description box below for the full recipe. And as always, thank you so much for watching. Bye guys.